every little bit. What is up guys? It's time for the maiden voyage of the SS Press. I've had it out on the water once so far just to make sure there's no leaks, but today we will be actually fishing from it. We're gonna go out to Cross Creek, me and Pavel, and we're gonna do it to it. We're gonna go hard. No Byron today. If you watch for the dog, I'm very, very sorry. I'll put a really cute clip of him in at the end, I promise. That's how we're rolling today. Drop shot rig, jerk bait rig, my robo worm rig, pitching rig, big ass swim bait rig. You gotta go. I want to catch something big with this, like something like super big, like like big big. It's gonna happen. Are you calling? Yeah. There. Right. Okay, boats in the water. We are ready to roll. And yes, you can tow a boat with a car. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. You just have to be not a dumbass about the ramps you launch on. But for this one, this is a very mild ramp, so we're good. So, maiden voyage, here we come. Look at the robo worm juice. Damn. <laughs> so which ones did you say were the killers? Uh, use the chartreuse tip ones. These ones? Yeah. We'll oh. start with those and see see if they're hitting worms. Damn. Get so many worms. Hell yeah. Make sure you have it kind of weedless for in here. Like don't make sure you don't have much of the hook exposed. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're good. Water's a little darker than it usually is, but for the rain we've had, it's not, it's surprisingly still nice. <laughs> it's a dink, but it's the first fish of the day. Little guy. He ate it though. Hey, my, uh... Look, I bet you this bird might pick up that bass. It just like doubled around. Look. Watch him, dude. Watch him. He might get it. See him? See him looking at it? So, 
quick update. We just got hooked a little dink. And I don't think he lived. He's floating on top of the water. This hawk keeps circling it. Get it, boy. This is it, right here. Oh, he's scared. I got a little loud. Yes. <laughs> yes. Got him. <laughs> that was sick. I don't know if I got it though. He like, he like the bird it cried wolf. This little guy feels like, oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. There we go. I'll take him. Yeah, I'll take that for a first one. I didn't even feel him like hit that. See a big dude. Thank you. Thump, thump, thump. He's on. Oh, and he's off. <laughs> I took tension off for a second to like eat these snacks. <laughs> he came right off. Quick update for you guys. We caught those two and then it hasn't been really much since. I almost caught another one. But since that, I don't think either of us have had a real bite. So we're coming down deep. We're gonna try some deep water action down by these rocks. See what happens. I think I'm gonna give this monster swim bait I gotta send and uh, see what happens there. <clears throat> send in the swim bait. It's like an ocean lure. <laughs> Give it one more. One more for good measure. Nada. All right. I wonder what the outflow of this looks like. Well, on the other side of that hill. Gotta find some place kind of soft to pull this thing up though. Maybe up along that tree up there. Let's see, let's get out of the boat for a moment. Okay, quick update for you guys. We're gonna hop out of the boat for a second. And it sounds like this dam's flowing really hard. So we're gonna go see if there might be some kind of nice outflow and fish that, stretch our legs, get out of the sun for a minute. And uh, we'll see how this goes. Anything? Oh, hey, there we go. That could be something decent. Me and Paul were notorious for having a bad day in the lake and then finding a stream or a runoff close to it and just crushing like six or seven fish. So that would be clutch if that happened today, that would be awesome. And it seems to be where a little 
more well prepared than we usually are when we do this. So we're already ahead of the game. This hill's vicious though. It's gonna suck to walk back up though. Yeah. You know? <laughs> okay. There could be some fish in here. I'm gonna let you do you and I'm gonna hit this real deep spot right on the outflow. <laughs> See what happens here. My weight might not be big enough for this. Oh shit, Oh, <laughs> that was it. Wow, whatever just took that was a monster. <laughs> All right, back in there. You have a heavier weight. You might be way better off than me. Oh. Oh. I don't believe it. I didn't believe at first. Yeah. Here we go. Nice little guy right here. Don't catch them all, Pavel. Come on. Just a couple. Oh. Oh. He came off by himself. Oh. Oh, it's a fighter. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. That's a beer right there. Pablo, he got brave and that happened. <laughs> Pumping the thighs. Pumping the thighs. Oh, I just stepped in a raunchy puddle. Well, let's try this side. We made it. Our boat's still way over there. Some canoes. Let's do this. There's a reward. <laughs> Is it still? Oh, it's so mushy. All right, it's been pretty slow. And uh, we got some monsterish black clouds right above us. We were cool with it until it started lightning. And uh, I mean, we only have like an hour left to fish anyway, so we're gonna get off the lake. to the boat ramp. Here comes the rain. We're giving her all she's got, Captain. Made it without getting too wet. All right, to the car. The storms are coming.
<laughs> Pobbles at the boat. Sorry, dude. We totally didn't make it. <laughs> I can feel my butt like so wet. I got back really fast. Yeah, it did. Came out of nowhere. I mean, we saw it coming, but it was just like. By the time we're like, okay, it's bad enough, we should leave, it was like... <sighs> as soon as I hopped in the car, it was like, the hard shit started, and I was like, oh, sorry, Pavel. <laughs> I didn't even care. That was the up point. I was like, what are, we gonna, what are we gonna do? All right, guys, we're ready to hit the road. It was a fun day, but this rain, we're soaked. I'm hungry. I'm tired. It's been an epic adventure. Guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that like button. Hit the subscribe if you're not a subscriber yet. And uh, until next time, Huggy Bear, peace.